hello guys welcome to my channel in this tutorial we are going to learn about one signal and how to use in laravel first of all what is one signal maybe you know about one signal but let's i explain you what is one signal one signal is a great platform for send a notification to your mobile applications web applications and email if you want to implement notification in your mobile app then you can do it with using one signal one signal provide a rest apis and supports many language let's check official documentation of one signal rest api here is a official documentation of one signal one signal provide a lots of api for create notifications view apps create apps view device view single device add and edit device you can create segment and delete segment you can also export csv file of your device so you need to create one application in one signal and you can implement one signal in your application one signal provide lots of language support you can see here all language example listed here so you can send a notification through many way uh, send single user send on uh, multiple user send one signal one, one segment send multiple segment so all kind of support provided by one signal you can integrate one signal in php with this example here is given send push notification example with bunch of line code in your application you can paste this code and use it in your laravel application if you want to integrate one signal you need to write this all lines and this method so i write laravel wrapper for one signal so uh, it's easy to use and you can install with composer in your application so let's take example with this package this package is uh, in under construction and lots of uh, api support added and missing api support add as soon as you can send push notification get notification and get all device get single device you can create device and update device with this package and other api support i will add soon so now package is installed successfully now we need to publish a vendor so copy this line and paste in your terminal publishing complete you need to register facade in app.php and also you need to add provider in app.php i already added so let's check you need to add facade here and you need to add provider here so now uh, configuration is set up but you need to specify authentication app id and authorize key in your dot env file you need to add these two 
key in your environment file and here is a one signal config file so package take your app id and authorize from here so you can set it here and let's check where this app id and authorize you can find it you need to log in on one signal and you need to go key and ids you can see here app id and you can see your app key app key means authorize and you need to paste app id here and you need to copy app key and need to paste here so now configuration is complete and you can use it one signal in your laravel application so i have created some example in my application so let's check i created one method send push notification you just need to write one line one signal and call one method send push notification with required details you need to include in include player ids you need to give array of player ids and specify message here for push notification you need to write this message and give as a parameter in this method this method support message parameter but you need to implement uh, this message in multiple languages that time you uh, can customize content and specify in fields if you specify in content that time you no need to pass message message method sorry variable because this contents overwrite this message in send push notification method so you can pass all the parameters in field array which supported by one signal you can check in official documentation which parameter supported by one signal next is you can get all notification you need to just write this one line and get all the notification of your application from your one signal app also you can get single one single notification just you need to specify notification id same way you can get all the device of your application from one signal just you need to write one line and you can get it in documentation you can see here once offline you need to write if you set up manually but if you use this package it's very easy and it's reduce a code also reduce your time and save your time so please use it this package for one signal implementation thank you for watching the video please do not forget to subscribe my channel please like video and share video thank you